era ba kuwaja wali singa kuwa kwa imbile yesi ba kula kila kiri kile kura menga kumbara ati kile kusaji kwe kuna tu makobi dasi eta yoyo yo. kura menga kumbara mu kuchaka lenga niwa chaka lenga niwa na huwa wali anlufu no nga wei tsile musi za shefe shino sha yuganda uh, his excellency jeno yoyo yi kakuta musebe ni nganye president yuwa yuganda ara ambashika lina ali kubo nara huu pili sakuro mbele kama kambila ate kuhitu nise muzi bilisa ii nyaraku kila guru wale guno kwa rafu sara 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 ilana ambasa mshiruli kamuri imbu kayoyo aku rakele tu kwa 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 hii mbela yoyo niya kura iya kuyeta ufuara kukienda ukalina habita kila mbona kulibara nishe sikana kuma anana sange sikia manuwa COVID-19 nini sikene mbali hindi ufuro ushiri nye nda binda hii nda kumeti ya kuma konga ninyala kubo nye mikurele la kamaresi kwe kuku geba nda nyo kuku gemela hata ayo Shia isi kuku kuku onge na muka maani pefu Mumu vili kwefu Muna kovidi ya bea anga kuwamba Anyara wako vilisa kufi nguwa mundi ya sifakate machari Sivano lecho kumu kolo kuri ya nukwe shareo Kwa wime ni ime mission Kwe huwa apilisa Uwa na kuri Kumanya kuri kovidi ya liyo Ate kuike mesi Ndoku nyale kura manga kuri bala mu Singaba ndiwe yonge lirundi huku kubura. Nenga aruli o yui. Isi kuna banga kwa hake mwere bandu wakari at least. Aba andu saamu kubu lichikubi mwisita kabele gemele. Kali ya boka mwete ndaikulimi masikita awe. Afu nyarata. Kwe kuma huu nyowa. Covid afila munu na huru kwe. Kasa semba ni ninai. Ni nara kuambiso munu huko. Ni nara manga banja ndeba senye Sina kusaru sine Seba na onele Ate ni kawu kawu kawa kawa kili ni mwisi So ikanyara kuti na kuti ya uo mundo kwa mtawu So singa kwa kwa hali ndi kwe hindi le hoi Kene hurame kumbara mu Kunyare kutu wa soni I want to thank The deputy director so I heard he was here of uh, women with a mission. Is she there? Where is she? I want to thank you and your organization for the initiative of awakening our people. First of all, to understand that we still have COVID amidst us, and however, government has put in place interventions of ensuring that this uh, virus does not continue spreading and affecting our people. That's why there is drugs for, for vaccination. I want to thank you that this campaign you are carrying out in this Zimbabwe city is going to help our people. First of all, to appreciate that the COVID-19 is still there, and also know that we still have vaccines, and it's the only way we can eliminate it totally amid the stars. And also I want to thank you that you made an initiative of, of at least ensuring that people within us, although they fear to put on the masks, but they have at least had them, uh, to ensure even when we gather here, uh, they don't again uh, get it or they don't bring it and give it to other people here. You can go back. So I thank you on behalf of the President. I assure you my commitment as the, the Chair of COVID to support you in this endeavor. Thank you.
put on your face mask to avoid the spread of the virus. If all of this is done, we shall tell our husband. Uh, my name is Betty Wali Salamu. I'm the team leader at Women with a Mission. I lead the team. Uh, briefly about Women with a Mission is Women with a Mission is a human rights uh, based organization, women led, a feminist organization, uh, which was uh, established to respond to gender based violence, sexual reproductive health human rights, but also health related problems among the community members. Uh, today, Women with a Mission is launching a campaign called Get Shots, Get Shots into Arms campaign. Uh, this is mainly to, to increase uh, COVID-19 vaccine acceptance and uptake among rural and urban poor. As we know that uh, the community sees COVID-19 as a Western setting, a Western thing, but not knowing that also the COVID-19 has come to affect us and it's part of us, it's a new norm. So we have come to sensitize the community that since COVID is with us, the only way for us to protect ourselves, protect people from dying, we saw it in the second wave. Each one of us has a relative, a friend, a community member who passed on because of COVID. So we are sensitizing people to increase awareness on the safety, effectiveness of COVID-19, that COVID-19 vaccine, that this vaccine is safe, whereas it has some minor effects, but it's safe for us to protect ourselves from the deadly COVID-19. Because as we know that the health system is not as as good as as other countries, even those which had good health systems like USA, we saw very many people in millions dying. That's where we are here in the community of Raso. It's now it's no longer Raso sub counties within this uh, northern division, but we are here within Raso to mobilize people to come and vaccinate themselves against the deadly disease, which is now has come to be part of us, which is COVID-19 vaccine. So uh, I'm trying to call upon the community, not only in Raso, not only in Bali, but wherever we are within our communities, the whole of Uganda, that let's vaccinate. Let, we can do this, we can protect our families, we can protect everyone from dying because of this deadly disease. Thank you for God and my country. As, as I as I had earlier said that we do advocacy around sexual reproductive health. Sexual reproductive health needs is a, it's a wider thing. When you talk about sexual reproductive health, it brings in issues of HIV, it brings in issues of uh, STIs, uh, many things. So as women as I mentioned, we also do interventions around increase on prevention, treatment and care of, of people who within the communities that those who are HIV positive, let's uh, continue taking ARVs. Those who are not already enrolled on art, let's uh, be encouraged. Community, let's not stigmatize people who are living with HIV. That an HIV person, positive person, can live longer when you take properly your ARVs. So uh, as women with a mission, we sensitize people that let's prevent, if you're not HIV positive, let's ensure that we put on condoms. If you've gone some, with someone and you're not aware of their, their status, we can, put, we can take post PEP. This is uh, which prevents you from, from taking, from getting or acquiring HIV. But even then we also have pre that you can take to prevent yourself that you're going to engage in sex with someone who you don't know their status, you can take the, 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 the prep, prep, prep. So uh, we encourage people that let's test, know your partner's status so that we can be HIV-free uh, Uganda.